Now, in this part, we are going to talk about components in Blade files, how we can create and use a reusable code or make a component and use it multiple times in our Blade file. So, in our student had, we have this validations error we are display all the validations errors if there are any same code we have inside our add.blade.php instead of writing this in multiple places we can make it simpler by writing it once and call it multiple times by creating a component so let's see how we can make a component for that we in the terminal we have to type php artisan make component then the component name so in our case let's call it errors component enter now this will create two files inside our project one inside app views component and component errors component dot php and another one inside resources views then component and finally our component itself in here we have to type our html part and in the errors component.php in here we have to write the logic or the data that we want to send inside the view of the component so let's go inside our add and move this error checking logic to but so the validation checking logic to that inside the component so let's paste it in here now let's click save now to call this component inside our add we just have to type x dash then the component name so errors component and we have to close it now let's save Let's go back to our project and set the teacher, add teacher. Now, if I submit this empty form, let's click submit. I get my validations error, same as previous. Now, let's move this to inside our students as well. So, let's go here and replace it with our component. Save. Now, let's go back to our student click add submit now we got our error messages same like a previous we can also pass data with a, to our component from our main page to send a data for example let's open our component first we want to send this class name from our add.blade to the component so let's cut it from here and let's go to add in here let's create a new attribute with the name of class name and paste our classes here now after that inside my errors component dot php and the before that construct method in here i have to create a variable so let's type public and the variable name which is class name then inside the construct method we have to pass the class name as a parameter and inside the method itself we have to type this class name is equal to class name that's it now let's save and now inside our errors component blade file to use that variable we just have to type the variable name like this class name now let's copy this inside our students uh, teachers as well so let's pass it here save now let's go back refresh our page now let's uh, click submit we got our validations and also in the teacher let's click add submit now we got our validation in both places in students and in the teacher so this is how we can create and use a component in the laravel